his car into a crowd in Charlottesville, Virginia, will be in court this morning. The incident at a rally of white nationalists has led to widespread marches for peace and tolerance across the nation. Hannah Doba has the latest. The man suspected of ramming his car into a crowd in Charlottesville, Virginia, is scheduled to appear in court today. 20-year-old James Alex Fields Jr. faces several charges, including second-degree murder. He's accused of killing 32-year-old Heather Heyer and injuring 19 others. Fields, seen here just before the incident, was attending the Unite the Right rally, a white nationalist protest against plans to remove a Confederate statue from a public park. Vigils, rallies and marches were held across the country yesterday in support of the victims and against hate from Florida to Chicago, Michigan to Seattle. A mother had to bury their child. In Charlottesville, Marcus Martin, the focus of the picture that captured the moment of the attack, described how he took the hit to potentially save his fiance's life. I hear tires screech. Then I look up and I see people getting thrown in the air. And the only thing I could do was push my fiance out of the way. President Trump faced criticism from both sides of the aisle over the weekend for not strongly condemning white supremacists at the rally. Virginia's governor called on all politicians to take a stand. Tell white supremacists, tell the neo-Nazis, right. tell the KKK, tell them all. We've had enough of it. After President Trump's initial response, the White House did issue a more strongly worded statement, specifically condemning the extremist groups and calling for national unity. Anadoba, CBS News.